boy, uh, people, I tell them on this country is something else. Who said them love Jamaica? Think about it. We love Jamaica because we love the land. We love the land. About the system. You love the system. You love the way the thing set up. Because as soon as the man them said them had to look at rally, all the whole pound, whole pound out there rally with them. That shows that when we out there rally with them, I don't know want to look at food. Then maybe they cook some food or maybe whatever, but when I eat that, I said that. When you need to go find something else to do instead of going around there, rally with the man them. Because the man when I rally with for them pocket full. So you need to try to fill your pocket by going around that day, then I better go rally. And that's why I say, because the system is set up to keep the poor man poor and keep you stressed out. Why the white man set them system to make the white people them go through easy? And we were living in the white man country, we get a benefit from that. And we then set it for. They set it for themselves. But we, we did it, benefit from it. I got to the topic where we really want to talk about. If you have a vehicle, and you have a vehicle parked for probably 10 years, 5 years, just park up. And you can't find a tiger. Your tiger, your tiger get destroyed. Maybe in a flood. Rat name up the paper. Or fire or something. Stolen or something. And you want another tiger. You got a tax office. Show your ID. Show you this. Show you that. Check so you just uh, They might just print out another tiger. And you go on about your business. So you can go sell this old vehicle. No. Not a Jamaica land here. You're asking to go to your insurance company, go get an old copy of your insurance. Then, like them not have that in their system, you know? them supposed to have that in their system because you know? your vehicle was licensed and was driving. So they have it in their system. But no, and that's a black people do it. We are saying you go do some work. We can walk up and down and make a kitchen taxi, spend some money, stay poor. So now you have to go get an old copy of your paper, insurance paper. Then you have to go pay your money at tax office. They never carry your old vehicle, get, get it fit up. Fit up on the road. Remember, you know? You want to sell the vehicle as is, you know, as how it is. To someone where I go fix it up and them go get it fit. So you know, now you go fit up your vehicle. Now this vehicle go fit up two times in a row. So more money in them pocket. You see? You see how simple that should not be? Them just look on your ID, check them systems to say yo 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 and then give you a title for the vehicle you then tell them say so you take the vehicle go drive it so you see who say them love the country this is an experience I go through but I am speaking about it but what if we just take it and just go on and just go stressed out I am speaking about it because something shouldn't be simple it's so hard so we have a whole bunch of people in Jamaica who are just stressed out and depressed and lost hope and discouraged. Because, to be honest, I am almost there. When I feel like I just want to sell this and sell that and run go and white man country go live. Because I can benefit half of how them set for them system. I can benefit because they set it for them one another and we get to enjoy it. But black government, not only in Jamaica alone, but many other places, are so we run with things. Because at the time when you keep the people them stressed out, you are stuff your pocket. And how wicked is that for you know, say, yo, you on top and you can make changes and make your country run good and make people love you and make you stay in the office forever. In this system of Jamaica where you can stay in the office forever. First world country, you can't stay no more than two terms. Yeah, so you can't stay forever. And for just make your people love you. And listen to the radio and listen to the complaint of the people them on the radio. And hear the things they want to fix and fix it. So we don't have to just struggle so much. Come in and know why me need to deal with something and me have to run here, run there, run go, St. Thomas, run go, mob here, run, and you have a computer sitting in front of you know? Why all of this? Why me need one bird service ticket? And me have to, you know, go through and wait and think when you can print out right then like first world country do it. For all those people who don't know, I am telling you, you get your bird service ticket 
print out right then as you apply for it. You print out and you get it. Why we have to wait seven days? Why we have to pay extra money to get it faster? Why we have to wait so long to get a driver's license? When you print out right then a first world country. Done. Same day. Not whole day, no. Same day. I am fed up. And the next move is just to sell off and let go. And I'm speaking for all I people then where I go through this. I go many places and I see people just fed up and then shake their head and walk out of the place. Because that's how we set it. And you want to tell us that we have a government we just I keep with this way. And now we can't pay with taxes, we can't pay this, we can't pay that. China them just are take it. Because you take it and they'll give it to China after we can't pay it. I pray that there will, some, there will be a leader will come in and just say, yes, time for change and make some changes. And I also pray say England would and just step in and just say, yo, we're sending some people to come help you know, manage the government because we black people can't do it. Thanks for listening and share, share.